that we are doing for collabulary. And our first collab is going to be with Peke May and her video and link and stuff is going to be in our down bar, so go check that out. It's going to be a winter lookbook. And what we're doing on our channel for the collab is a makeup tips and tricks for the winter. So make sure you stay tuned and watch that and go check hers out. Okay, so to start my eyes off, I'm using the Too Faced Natural Eyes Palette. And I'm using the shade Silk Teddy. And I'm just applying that all over my lid with a um, e.l.f shadow brush and then I'm going in with the color cashmere bunny and it's just a very nice um, neutral brown shade that is great for the crease which is where I'm putting it today and I am just putting that out completely all the way to the outer corner to the inner corner and then following that I'm using a different blending brush and using the darkest brown shade in the palette and I'm going to be applying this shade in the outer corner of my eyes and I'm also having some issues focusing stuff in this but everything will be listed in the down bar that I'm using and I also will be telling you what it is so you'll be good and you'll know what it is and I'm just yeah like I said I'm applying that in the outer corner of both my eyes and just blending that out and I'm blending it in a little bit to my crease but not too much so just a little bit from where the other shade is as well and then now I'm going in with the first shade I use the Silk Teddy and using the same brush that I used originally for that and I'm just reapplying that to add more color in over top the darker shades because it kind of got rid of that brightness so there's that and I'm also gonna take this up a little bit in my inner corner and up as I'm doing here Okay, so the next shade I'm using is the shade Heaven, and it is a highlight shade. And it's a little bit light, I think, personally, so I'm blending it out. First, I applied it with an angled eyeshadow brush, and then I blend it out with my finger just to have it more seamless. And so it's not so intense. As you can see, it's pretty light. So that's why I'm doing that. And after I do that, I'm going to be using my Ico Fat Liquid Eyeliner. And I'm doing just a basic line. I'm not adding a wing or anything today. Um, but you can always add a wing if you want. So it's your preference, your how comfortable you are with it. Um, in this eyeshadow, it's kind of hard to use in the inner corner just because it's so fat. You know, but it's okay. And then I'm using my Sephora Eyelash Curler right now and just curling all my eyelashes make sure you get it all the way to the lash line and curl up and then I'm using my Bare Minerals Lasting Line eyeliner in absolute black and I'm just going over that other eyeliner just to add more color kind of deepen the black up a little bit and also fix that inner corner so it's not so jaggedy and so there's that my eyeliner and my shadows now I'm using the Benefit There Real Eyelash Primer and it's in mink brown which is unusual because usually uh, mascara primers are in white so that's nice the last shadow I'm going to be using today is from my Smashbox Full Exposure Travel Palette and it's just the super shimmery gold shade I'm just taking that on a flat shader brush and going right on my lower lash line and I really pack this on because I think it's really pretty and it really adds something special I think and I'm also going to be going in with that same shade into my inner corner to kind of add a brightening effect so there is my eye very pretty very green as you can see and now I'm using my L'Oreal Telescopic Shocking Mascara and I'm not a huge fan of this mascara but you know that's just life sometimes and now I'm using the Benefit Roller Lash on my lower lash line because I really like how that works with my lower lashes it makes them very long now I'm using my Stila Huge 
mascara, which is one of my favorite mascaras. It is very voluminous and it's very pretty and it's a good mascara. So I'm using that as well. And there are my eyes all done. Now I'm using my Tarte Amazonian Clay Blush in the shade Magic. And I'm just using a Maybelline blush brush to apply this. And I'm blending it out onto my apples and my cheeks. And then back a little bit. As you can see, I'm doing that here. Now I'm going to be using my Bare Minerals All Over Face Color in the shade True. And that first blush I applied was actually matte. And this is very shimmery, so... I like to layer these two. I think they look really pretty together and they add um, a nice effect, especially for the winter time. And now I'm using my two NARS um, lip pencil things, lipstick pencils that I got at Sephora for like my birthday gift. And I'm using the pink shade first, which you can just leave it at that. You can use the pink shade and that's it and you can be done or you can layer them on top of each other which is what I'm going to be doing today but if you're not super comfortable with red lips or anything then this shade is gorgeous on its own so there's that and then uh, I'm going to be using the red shade and I'm just applying that right over top because they actually go together pretty well they don't there's no weird looking effect that happens so there's that and you can go over with a concealer if you want afterwards. Um, I'm just going to kind of touch it up with my fingers a little bit. And I think it looks fine. So there's that. Now I'm using my Jelly Pong Pong Glow Gitter, which is a gel luminizer, so like a gel highlight. And this is my absolute favorite highlight. I think it's gorgeous. It's so shimmery and it blends so well into the skin. I'm just using my finger to blend it out. But you can use a brush or whatever if you want. And so I'm just putting that onto the very top of my cheekbone to bring that out. And then here I am applying it on my other cheekbone. I'm also going to be applying it a little bit onto my Cupid's bow, which is just the piece right above the little dip in your lips. So there's that. And there's the makeup done. check out all our links in the down bar and there's going to be our facebook our instagram um our twitter's down there as well so go check all that out and follow like subscribe everything and we'll see you guys soon bye